boy says go. Pulled it one ten. Back with a sharpened chain, so let's see how she goes.
torture test. Boost. Wheel. We've got another car out here. He's... There's a wheel ruts full of water just over there and he didn't want to go in it. He went, like started going in it. Over near that other log. The one that's on the uneven ground over there, like, and uh, he's turned around to go back out. Ah, uh, yeah, she's hectic. The that little ported one ten. Doesn't matter what you throw at it, the bar length you can go over, like. When I built it, you know, the, the torture log, the big log that I've been cutting with the 125 and the, like all the 24, 25 inch tests a couple of series ago, I actually made a cut. I cut a cookie off that with that 110. It's off its head. Um, I think I need to put a pipe on it. It's still running the stock. The stock setup, it's got a little hole drilled out of the middle piece. You know, the little, where the spark arrestor screen goes on the, these. There's no threads in that hole and I drilled it out. So I reckon it needs a pipe. What do you guys think? I got like an iron horse style pipe at home that Darcy made for a CS5000 Echo. 
it's about that long. I could probably stick my thumb in there. It probably needs a little bit bigger pipe, probably 22 mil, which is what? Three quarter. Next size up from three quarter. 11 sixteenths, I think it is, or seven eighths. Seven eighths pipe. I reckon I'd make a iron horse style pipe. For it, or maybe like a header pipe. Make it come out, curl back, and then put a stinger on it. I reckon it needs a pipe. I can get more RPMs out of it, but it doesn't want to keep chugging along. And I believe it still points. I can't remember. I haven't put the actual build. I haven't put the actual build video up. I've the uh, fuel fuel hose replacement was filmed on this. This is flat because I forgot my tripod. This was on that tripod. This is just like a little time lapse selfie stick thing. I think it still points. I can't remember. I'd have to pull the engine back out again or have a look at that video of the fuel. I'm pretty sure the points plate's still under the flywheel. I was going uh, electronic. But I haven't yet. If I have, I forget. Uh, Darcy. I know you're going to watch this. The 110 I said you have, that's the one with the bucking spike. If you take it, can you make me six, please? One, two, three. Four, five. I know I've got six. Mini Max. Actually, is that? Yes, that has the holes for it. Beautiful. That needs a bucking spike. Because when I ran that one, that was heaps heaps easier with the spike. Well, I could make them, but I don't have a grinder, so. Well, I do. I've got a five inch somewhere, but I can never never know where it is when I need it. Um, I need another four inch so I can hold it in one hand. My five inch has got a trigger at the back and a handle, so. Yeah, hectic day. I almost want to run the 2511T clone again. Actually, no, I'll leave it. We'll do another video on it, another tank. Another tank, I need to, Adjust the rakers properly or buy a new brand new 12 inch chain. Actually, I got a 12 inch 050 on the Mac that I was supposed to bring today, which was a 2.0 Wega Beaver, guys. Um, that's got to come back out. The 120 with the spark issue. It's probably earthen. I'll, I'll wrap the HT lead with tape. I reckon it's earthen itself to the bottom of the case. Or the kill switch. I remember the tab for the kill switch was bent a little different to the others. Uh, okay. So the 310. Ew. It's probably the star of my YouTube channel. I reckon. Everyone loves it. Well, Chris loves it. I love it. Darcy's loves it. It's probably this is probably the reason he wants his 110. He actually built a 110 with a full wrap handlebar. The little matchbox muffler off the 25s. Or the mini max uh, power. What was it? A McCulloch Mac. 
Mini Max 6, the first one with the integrated starter. She gets warm. This still has the little zigzag sprocket on. I'm going to change it to a proper spur. This has still got that little zigzag thing on it. I'm going to swap that out. It might up the chain speed because it'll be bigger, not smaller. That makes sense. This actually has one of those on it. Is it this one? No, that's got the zigzag. The other Mac 120 with the Eager Beaver starter. It's actually got the spur. So like these. Uh, Power Mac 6. Actually, I'll finish it there and I'll do another one so I can explain everything. Thanks for watching. Hooroo. Hope you love it. I love it. She's a boost.